Did you know that there's a city in China rapidly surpassing Silicon Valley in technology? The latest sensation, DeepSeek, which is revolutionizing AI development, hails from this city. Not only DeepSeek, but other Chinese startups from this city are also challenging American tech giants and reshaping the global tech landscape. One small AI company caused the evaporation of nearly a trillion dollars in the U.S. stock market. A machine dog created by a 90s academic underachiever made Elon Musk retweet and praise it, and a game company made foreign players flock to learn Chinese. They are known as the Six Little Dragons, from Hangzhou, a mysterious power from the East, according to foreign media. Let's see what they've done. First, let's talk about the first dragon, DeepSeek. Do you know how much it costs to train an AI model comparable to GPT-4? OpenAI spent about $100 million, but DeepSeek achieved the same result with just $5.58 million, even open sourcing the code. What's even more impressive is that DeepSeek used only 2,048 GPUs and completed training in 53 days. The same model would have required at least 16,000 GPUs for other companies. Overnight, DeepSeek surpassed ChatGPT and topped the US App Store. After the news broke, Silicon Valley was shaken. NVIDIA's stock plummeted by 17% and nearly $600 billion evaporated overnight, setting the record for the biggest one-day market value loss in US stock history. The team that achieved this miracle had fewer than 140 people, most of them recent graduates from Tsinghua University and Zhejiang University. The second dragon is even more interesting, Unitree Technology. The founder, Wang Xingxing, a 90s academic underachiever, had poor English and failed his courses, but managed to create a robot with just $30. After spending only two months at DJI, he dared to go solo. People laughed at his ambition, but now his robots hold 60% of the global market share, with giants like Amazon, Google, and Meta queuing up to buy. By the end of 2024, Unitree released its latest robot dog, B2W. This robot dog can scale mountains, jump high, carry heavy loads, and even perform three 60-degree flips like a parkour master. Elon Musk couldn't resist retweeting it, saying the future of warfare is in drone technology. What's most remarkable is their pricing strategy. While other humanoid robots cost at least $70,000, Unitree sells theirs for just $16,000. Their robots, dressed in bright floral coats, performed a traditional Chinese dance at the Chinese Spring Festival Gala. The third dragon is the legendary black myth, Wukong, the biggest Chinese-made game of 2024. It set new records for single-player games, and its sales have skyrocketed to 1.26 billion US dollars. Foreign players, eager to try the demo version, have even learned Chinese. What's even more surprising is that this game, which has stunned the world, was developed by a team of only 140 people. The founder, Feng Ji, was once a gaming addict who gave up opportunities for further studies just to play World of Warcraft. Feng Ji said that the journey to learn the scriptures was more important than reaching the spiritual mountain and he led his team to shut themselves off for seven years in Hangzhou to prove that China can also produce world-class games. Next is the fourth dragon, BrainCo Technology. Their intelligent bionic hand is not just a mechanical prosthesis. It is a high-tech product that can understand brain waves. Without surgery or craniotomy, disabled people can control the prosthetic hand with their minds. Writing, playing the piano, stacking blocks, anything they want to do. One of the most touching moments occurred at the Asian Paralympic Games, when an athlete controlled the prosthetic hand with their mind to light the main torch, bringing tears to many. Don't be fooled by their current success. In the early days of the startup, founder Han Bicheng was conducting experiments in a basement at Harvard, washing his hair 30 times a day. His mother was so scared, thinking he was washing hair for others. Today, this hair-washing guy leads a team that is one of only two brain-computer interface companies in the world to have raised over $200 million. 
The fifth dragon is more hardcore. Deep Robotics. This company was the first to bring Chinese robots into the Singapore power grid. Their Ju Ying X-30 robot dog can walk freely on a 45-degree slope, cross complex terrain, and function normally in temperatures ranging from negative 20 degrees Celsius to 55 degrees Celsius. What's most impressive is its ability to inspect power equipment, identifying faults in just a few seconds, several times faster than humans. Finally, the last dragon is ManyCore technology. When Silicon Valley giants sent them emails, they thought it was a scam. Who would believe that an obscure company from Hangzhou could become the eastern powerhouse of global AI training? In fact, they hold the world's largest 3D model library with 320 million models. Even Tesla's Shanghai factory uses their technology to reduce debugging time from eight weeks to just 11 days. Even more surprisingly, they can replicate 99% of real-world materials, which is like sending AI to school so robots can learn in a virtual world before entering the real world. Why Hangzhou? The answer is actually hidden in the city's DNA. The talent magnet of Zhejiang University and Westlake University has made Hangzhou the hub for China's strongest tech forces. The entrepreneurial ecosystem here is extraordinary with a complete industrial chain from chip development to robotics manufacturing and venture capital firms everywhere. Money is never a problem, and if the project is good, investment is immediately available. This is Hangzhou, where innovation is not just a slogan, but the city's very breath. Technology is not just a label, but part of daily life. This earthly paradise is quietly transforming into China's Silicon Valley. So, what do you think? Will this Chinese city surpass Silicon Valley in tech innovation? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated on the latest trends in Chinese technology.